So today the 18th of March 2020, I was photographing just outside the window of the guest bedroom of my house showing my brother. And I didn't see this object as it passes by when my finger was pointing. There it is again. And what I didn't see until much later was to the right in the center of the screen to the right coming passing over my finger is a second UFO and after that they disappeared and all that remained was what was there during the UFOs were, the, uh, were also there, the streak in the sky. Apart from the cylindrical objects this streak in the sky reminds me of the ebonies which spit out orbs. Many cases of such have been recorded, such as these orbs in a V formation, which were photographed by more than one witness over Seattle, and some which were filmed, which were sent into the film company of uh, Jaime Mossan in Mexico. Here's another example of an ebony taken over the skies of New Mexico. And now looking at my ebony below the two UFOs, which in some, in the video, I don't see the ebony at all. We can see a very strange shape here, close up, more squared and split up into pieces, which is extremely strange. And looking at the object itself, I can see a ribbed kind of uh, circle around the edge, showing it seems to be manufactured. Two minutes later I came back up and it was gone and all that was left was this streak in the sky. And five minutes later some clouds had formed and it was all gone. I was further amazed to find out that not only on the above left here as we zoom in there was this object that I have revealed in my video, but that to the right, there was in the distance a further away object of the same type, which you can see here in close up. After that, there was just a streak in the sky, which I think is very similar to the Ebony's. And later here's what was left, just some clouds forming and the ebony was gone. As a final note, I'd like to express my opinion that I think the shimmery effect around the edge that makes it look blurred is actually a clocking device and that this is the reason why I couldn't see it with the naked eye, nor could I photograph also considering where the sun was at the time, which was above my head and slightly behind me, and the tilt of the angle of this object reveals the reflections to uh, show that this is indeed a metallic reflective object. Very smooth, highly reflective and metallic. This enhanced black and white photo shows that the object seems to have another object concealed within its outer shell, perhaps concealing its true shape and identity. If you look carefully, you can see it has more of a bowler hat shape on the outer rim but seems semi-transparent. And on the inner side, you can see like an ice cream cone shape. And it seems to have portholes around the edges or some kind of ribbed formation. So maybe that is the ship within and the outside shape is a force field of invisibility or what you would call in Star Trek, a cloaking device most famous with the Klingons, of course, and the Romulans.